Today I'm going to show you how to make this military Garangi text effect in Photoshop. I'm going to start an Illustrator and create that really cool text. Click. By the way, I went with the Akira font. I'm going to right click, create outline, and I'm going to right click on group. And you can rearrange the text. And I'm going to select the direct selection tool and select this part of the letter P and make it more longer. And I'm going to customize the rest as well. As simple as that. Okay, so I'm ready. I'm gonna select the text, press Ctrl C, go to Photoshop, press Ctrl V. I'm gonna go with Smart Object, click OK, press and hold Alt, scale it up. Click on the Smart Object layer with the text. Let's go to Filter, Blur Gallery, Field Blur. With this circle, basically, we can increase the dial and we're gonna add more and more blur. And I'm gonna go and click here also, and here I'm gonna decrease the blur, for example. Bottom one is gonna be more blurry. And it looks something like this. I'm gonna go here, click OK, press and hold Shift, select both of the layers, right click, convert to Smart Object, and I'm gonna go to Filter, Noise, Add Noise. I'm gonna make it monochrome and increase the amount. Click OK. And now I'm going to drag a texture on it. I'm going to leave a link in the description with the texture so you can download it. And I'm going to go to the blend mode and select the hard light. And from here, I'm going to go to the adjustments, scroll up, and let's select the levels. And I'm going to push up all the way somewhere here and also increase the middle handle. And it's going to create this really cool grunge effect. I want to also decrease the blur is too much. I'm going to double click on the layer, double click here on the blur gallery. And this way I can reduce the amount of blur in some of the areas. Click OK, go to File and click on Save. And let's go here back to the tab. Yeah, look at that. I'm also going to click on the top level, go back to the adjustments, and I'm going to go to the hue saturation and I'm going to change the hue to green and I'm going to decrease the saturation a little bit. And this is how you make this grungy text effect in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.